Hey, what's going on you guys? DJ Zeus with a different type of video today. Today I'm actually going to be reviewing one of the Food Truck Series sandwiches from Jack in the Box. So, stick around. DJ Zeus. Alright, so as I said, I'm going to be reviewing one of their Food Truck Series sandwiches. I did have the, uh, it was like roast beef or something like that and that shit was amazing. So I figured why not make a video about it? Now this one here isn't the roast beef one, it's the Asian whatever it's called. You will have the title in the title of this video. I just can't remember right now off the top of my head because my mouth is salivating and I haven't eaten anything today. So let's dig inside and see what the sandwich looks like. Also, make sure to go ahead and hit subscribe Toasty. for future content like this and other product reviews. All right, so here in the bag, napkins. Ranch, ranch, you know, you need a little dab of ranch. All right, we got the little chicken sandwich, about the size of my hand. I do have a decent sized hand. Small ass ball of water, but it's almost about the same size, so not too bad. And then I had to get some onion rings because I wasn't digging the fries. Another thing to note, if you're interested in seeing what the prime rib one looks like, uh, Doug, uh, he did a video on his channel, so go ahead and check that out. Link will be right here, so go ahead and check that out when you're done watching this one. But let's dig in because I'm hungry. Opening this up for the very first time. When I received it in the car, this shit smelled delicious. So we got some chicken, some kind of sauce, two pieces of chicken actually, and some cucumber, which I wasn't expecting, and little shreds of um, carrots. So this is gonna be an interesting taste. I'm not sure if the buttermilk ranch is gonna go with this, but it'll definitely go with the onion rings. The bread feels like a little, it's not as soft as I was expecting it to be, but. Let's taste it. Hmm. What the hell? Okay, so first impressions of my first bite of the sandwich. The bread, I feel, was not as fresh as I was hoping it would be. Uh, I remember when I ate the prime rib one the other day, um, the bread was like really soft and it probably uh, was more fresh than this one here. That, I get, a, I give the bread a thumbs down. Um, the chicken is, is delicious. The sauce that's on there does have like an Asian-y taste. I guess that's why they call it the Asian chicken sandwich or whatever it is. Sorry, excuse me. I, this is what it's called. The cucumber just kind of like overtakes the rest of the sandwich. So for me, I'm gonna have to say it's all right, it's okay. Uh, but let me go ahead and take another bite. Look at Doug getting ready for his video. <laughs> Remember, he's got that prime rib on deck, so check out his video. So the more and more I keep sinking my teeth into this sandwich, I'm quickly reminded of their um, Asian Mandarin chicken sandwich or whatever. I'm uh, not the sandwich, their salad that they have. I don't know if they still have it, but I remember back in the day they used to have like this Mandarin orange chicken salad or something like that. That's kind of what this tastes like and that's what this dressing tastes like. It kind of tastes like that salad, Asian eat uh, tasting dressing. The chicken is delicious. The dressing is okay. The bread is kind of subpar, but um, overall it's all right. Is it is it worth the hype? Not really. Uh, I would actually prefer a Jumbo Jack over this, I gotta say. Doug's, Doug's sandwich is pretty amazing. I had that the other day and I wish I did a video of that. But um, also make sure to go ahead and hit subscribe. If you want, you can continue watching me eat, but that's pretty much it. Check out my other videos. That bite tastes a little bit better, but the bread still sucks. <laughs> 